Hey guys, what's going on? It's your boy LaRip8 here with another video. Now in this video, I'm going to be doing episode 4 of my Kex to Dex series. And I know it's been a while since I've uploaded. And it's been a while since I've uploaded for this series. That's because I've been having some things going on in my life. And I had to take care of those before this. So anyways, let's push that out the way and go back to the last episode last episode was when I showed you how to dump your EID rookie and upgrade to rebug 4.46 which I am still on guys don't worry not leaving you anytime soon okay so you should have your EID rookie in a folder I believe um, just make sure you have that before you watch this video but once you have that you want to go ahead and put your USB in the right port of your PS3 the right port it needs to be the right one and then you're gonna want to go ahead and launch rebug toolbox if you don't have it in here go to package manager install package files PS3 hard disk and it'll be in there and you can use that but once you have that you want to go ahead and launch it okay and once rebug toolbox is loaded up you want to go all the way to the right side on the utilities and scroll all the way down to export flash to file. Again, make sure you have your USB plugged into the right side and press X, hit yes. It'll do this up to 12 megabytes, I believe. And blah, 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 it's in your USB. Hit OK. And then you're going to come back to this screen after, but you need to meet me on the PC with your USB plugged in so I'll see you guys there okay guys so once you're on your PC with your USB plugged in you want to go ahead and open up the root of your USB and go ahead and get the new file and drag it into your pre-made stuff file that has your EID root key in there so let that copy over just like that and then you're actually going to go into that folder and rename this to flash cex and if instead of norbin you need to remember that though remember that it's norbin or nanbin it's going to be one of those two so mine's norbin rename it to flash kex dot bin hit yes okay so it's there okay so if you do not have like you can't see what type of file it is like a bin or mine was Norbin and you need to go ahead and search your whole computer however you do it and you need to search file extension search that Okay, and then once it finds it wherever, um, you're gonna go on that says show or hide file extensions. So click on that, and then it'll be in the advanced settings. And you're just gonna go through here and check off driver letters. Looking for it. Hide extensions for known file types. It's going to be checked. You just need to uncheck it and then click OK. And then they should show up and then you can change it to a bin file. Alright, so once you have that, you're going to go ahead and download this zip file called Dex Tools. Open it up with WinRAR or Zip Extractor, whatever you use. And you don't need these you just need the C2D folder so go ahead and drag that to your desktop and you can exit out of that I'm gonna exit out of this real quick okay and then inside the C2D folder there is going to be uh, 
C2 DEXE, the DLL, the README, and the Win32 OpenSSL. You need to run the Win32 OpenSSL. And then the setup should come up. Click OK. Click Next. Uh, accept it. Next. For here, you need to make it just open SSL. Don't have the dash 132, so that messes it up. Click next, 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 ne install. Should go pretty fast. And then just uncheck this and finish. Then, after you have done that, you need to get your folder with your kex flash and your root key and drag this actually don't drag it you should probably copy them and paste them into here and then once they're in there you need to hit shift and right click at the same time in this little white space under here open command command prompt window and then you're going to do space c2d.exe flash no you need to do eid underscore root underscore key dot bin flash kex dot bin and then flash dex dot bin 82 hit enter then it's gonna run all of this stuff right here and then it'll say done you can go ahead and exit that and now you will have your EID rookie flash kex and your flash dex so now what you're going to do and I have a little file for this this is what you're going to rename this to see how I can position this there we go so your flash kex dot bin is going to be kex dot flash dot eid zero dot nor or nan bin whatever yours was mine was nor bin so hit that click yes it renames it your flash dex is going to be the same thing except it's going to be dex flash dot eid zero and then dot nor bin or nan bin whenever yours was then click yes so now you're going to go ahead and open up your USB again And it's always good to keep your original files, but in this case we already have it in the stuff folder, so I'm going to go ahead and delete it off my USB. And we're going to put the EID, the DEX flash, and the KEX flash. We're going to copy it, and we're going to paste it into the root of our USB. It has to be the root. Okay, so there's our files on the root of our USB. We can exit that. And you can make a folder. You can do it in the stuff or whatever. But this is your unmodified files. You can make like a folder. Like unconverted. Just like this. And then you can put these two. Mm. You can put these two files inside the unconverted. And you can make another file, uh, another folder. Called con 
inverted just like that and you can copy all three of these and paste these in here just like that so now you know the difference between your files which ones are converted and which ones are not converted after you do that you can uninstall that win32 that doesn't really matter you just needed those files to be converted or whatever so yeah guys this is the end of episode 4 of converting from kex to dex in my next tutorial I'm going to be showing you guys how to actually can how to switch to dex yeah that's what I meant to say switch to dex on your PS3 we just converted the files in this one so in the next one we're going to switch on our PS3 so that's gonna that's gonna the next fun part so I'll see you guys in episode 5 peace